All right, what's up, y'all? Check it out. This is Mike with Man Mike's Customs. Working on a 94 GMC Yukon SLE. Kind of restoring it. The glass was all bogus. All the glasses were dirty. Long story short, stay tuned. Check, ask questions, comment, like, subscribe. We are installing a driver fender. How do you do that? Well, if you watch my other videos, when you remove them, you got one, two, three, four, five bolts that hold the metal wheel well together, right? You have two bolts, one, two, one, two, on the rear. Uh, you have two up top right there, one, two, and then you'll have one on the front, right? And then you'll have one right here on this inner plastic piece on the other side. And then you'll access this one that's on the side of the fender. It was on the other, movie, other video that I put up. Long story short, I'm coming in here basically to swap the driver hood hinge. Uh, this video basically is a tutorial on a DIY on how to do your driver hinge. So essentially, it'll be a, it's a 14 or a 13. Don't quote me in the comments. I'm probably going to destroy me. But yeah, one bolt here, one bolt there. Um, I believe it's a 13 actually. Yeah, so a 13. You'll need a 13 wrench and a 13 socket with a wrench on it. And you'll have to grab the back side here with the ratchet and or with the wrench and then the ratchet on this side so you can crank it and hold it on the back or some vice grips and remove this bolt once you remove it you'll swap it over as you can see this fender is oe fender so it's got all brand new clips someone obviously was using this on a show truck i bought it from someone who parted a show truck which is why i got the fenders and they're painted black um right now we're just test fitting everything loosening up all the bolts eventually i'll come back in peel all the panels off primer paint and uh, doll up and repaint and spray the engine bay. That'll be another video. Stay tuned. If y'all want to see that paint video, drop a comment. Let me see how many people want to see me paint the inside of my engine bay. And if so, what color? Leave a comment. Let me know. Subscribe if y'all want to stay tuned. I actually enjoy what I do. This is me. So hopefully you guys like what you see. If you do, like, subscribe, comment, check it out. This is my name, Michael. I'm the owner of Mad Mike's Customs. And I hope you enjoy this content. Peace.